you know the song Stay Away by Alice in Chains? Oh, uh, Nirvana? Yeah. yeah. It starts like. Like, I think it's like. Hello and welcome. My name is Jake. I'm with Armadillo Studios here at the first ever Armadillo Underground Showcase at the beautiful ballroom in Austin, Texas. And I am honored to be with the first band of the evening, Whisk. Hi, everybody. Hey. Hi. Hey. Happy to have you all. Hello. hello. Hey, Why don't we start things off, go around the horn, and say your name, uh, what you do in the band, all that good stuff. I'm Vincent. I play the drums. Jacob, I play guitar. I'm Emily, and I sing. I'm Enrico, I play the bass. Right on. So Whisk is a fairly fresh band on the scene. Y'all's first show was December of last year, if that's correct? Yes. The Highball. The Highball, no. hell yeah. Meanwhile. Shout out Highball. Meanwhile Brewing. <laughs> Meanwhile Brewing, not Highball. <laughs> well, also, shout out both. Why not? Uh, how, did, how, did, how did everything come together? What's the, what's the history of the band? It got together. It, it all started with... Was it the summer with, last year? No. At the Alamo Draft House. Well, I guess so. Really, it started because... Oh, it's an Alamo story. Because <laughs> me, Jacob, and our friend Diego were supposed to hang out, and then Diego ditched. So then it was just Jacob and I, and we were just talking about music, and I was saying how I wanted to start a band. And he was like, I could start another band. And then the rest is history. <laughs> I was in one band at the time. <laughs> how many are you in that? Four. You're in four bands right now. Oh, wow, damn. you got a lot on your plate. We went to, it was Joe's Coffee, on South Congress. Mm -hmm. That's when the, that's when it all kind of came together. The meeting, the meeting of the minds. <laughs> <laughs> and how did the minds land on Whisk? The name Whisk. Well, we <laughs> we practiced a couple times with uh, this guy named Evan, and we went to Kane's one night, this and we were like, we had been thinking about band names, and we wanted something short and sweet. There were too many S bands, you know, like too many bands start with S which, you know, it's a great consonant, and I understand <laughs> why. But we didn't want to do S, and I think Emily just said whisk, and we are like, yeah. It was, Sounds cool. It just sounded good. Ends with a K. <laughs> whisk. Very, it's very hard. Very harsh. It does, more it more consonants. It's, more, a, it's like the second best consonant behind S. But one of them's silent, though, so. Ah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> that Is that right? <laughs> the H, silent? Oh, yeah, I was thinking H, but I was like, I don't really know what a consonant is. <laughs> yeah, I'm not now I know. Now, now I know. <laughs> so, uh, are y'all all from Austin originally, or how did, how did y'all meet? I'm, I was born and raised in Austin. I was not. Where are you from? I'm from the Dallas area. Nico <laughs> and I are both from Katie. Katie. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Shout out to Katie, Shout out Texas. to Katie. OG. Yeah. Katie, Texas. And Enrico, you're kind of uh, new in the band. Fresh, I'm fresh meat. Um, yeah, I I was in a, I'm in another band with Jacob, and they needed a bassist, and he hit me up, and I'm like, yeah, I I heard you guys these guys play before. They sound really cool, so I wanted to be part of it, play a show with them. So it's Enrico's first show. Yeah, first whisk show. I'm oh, sorry. Let's go. <laughs> Hello. First yeah, I'm very show. I'm very excited for it. It's a good venue for it too. So it's not just a. You know, I feel like a lot of first shows are usually pretty bad venue, but this one's really good and I'm excited for it, so. Is there a favorite venue y'all feel most comfortable playing at? This is one of them for me. I don't know, I like this place a lot. I've, I've played here a couple times. Uh, me, me personally, Swan Dive. Yeah, Swan favorite Dive. favorite venue to play. I like Mohawk, Mohawk's cool. Mohawk's also very cool. Mohawk, I think I would also say Mohawk. Or the Far Out is a pretty dope mm. spot Oh yeah, too. Far Lounge. I like Far cool. Lounge. Yeah. Like 13th floor is also a yeah. great spot. Do y'all have like a, a most like memorable moment from any of the shows y'all played in these venues? Took our shirts off at one Mohawk show. I was show. literally about to say that. <laughs> All of y'all took your shirts yeah. off. Yeah. Well, <laughs> me, and, me and Rico weren't in the band at the time. Oh, okay. Uh, but they also took their shirts off. Yeah, but I, I mean, I'll be doing it tonight. I'll, I'll, I'll take my shirt off tonight if you want. <laughs> if you want. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. Evan, who normally takes his shirt off, 
didn't take his shirt off, but me, Emily, and this guy named Jackson all took our shirts off. Just because it was hot or like? It just, it just rock and roll. Rock, rock and roll, dude. <laughs> yeah. My band played before that, and I, I want to say, and I influenced it because I took my shirt off at the end of that set. And, and then just, right. Followed. How do I follow that? All of us do. <laughs> Vincent's a trailblazer. Up you, man. Except the drummer, so we're not copying you. Right. So. They had to. Yeah. Right. So what are these other projects that y'all have gone on outside of Whisk? Me and Jacob are in this other band called Eddie Angel. It's really, really good. More R&B, soul, pop. It's really fun. I'm just in Whisk. Yeah. We've got Farmer's Wife. Farmer's Ooh, Wife. Shout out. Uh, my sister and I's band, formerly known as Sludge. Uh, we've been playing for... Almost two years come October. Yeah. And then I just joined a band called Straight Stitch with my friend Sean. And, uh, I'm in this one and I'm in also good, all caps period. Um, I also play the drums in that one too. So you, you and y'all and Claire sort of. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Uh, Luis and Luke are in good. So yeah. We're also all, on the we're all bill tonight. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's the first show we're all playing, but not in the same. Like not in the same set. Is it weird? Does it feel like you're sort of it feels cheating like a competition. on competition? <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, but it's cool. It's cool. How would y'all describe Whisk sound? Like whenever you take all those other projects and you come together as one, like how would you describe? Right. That's my favorite what, what question. question. Rock and roll. Rock. There's a little bit of grunginess to it. Um, a little bit of I guess poppy because of like the catchiness of the songs. Pop grunge rock. Sure. Pop rocks. Pop rocks. Pop rocks. It's a party in your mouth. Whisk. <laughs> Whisk. A party in your mouth. So that's pretty much all I have. What's uh, what's next for Whisk? Like, what, what do y'all what do y'all have coming up? Is there something that everyone can look out for? Yeah. Well, that we'll record some music. Put that out there at some point. And then we'll just like nee, 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 <laughs> all over town, you know? Sure. <laughs> Whisk the neon cat of Austin. Yes, there you go. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, thanks y'all so much. Uh, I can't wait you. to hear y'all's set, y'all sound check, y'all sound a badass. So thanks. I'm looking forward to it. Thanks for sitting down with me. Thank you, thank you. thank you for having us. Cool. Yeah, that was awesome. Thank you. Woo. Cheers.